Hello everyone and welcome. This video is a short video. I wanted to clarify a few things. So first things first, this object that I'm beside is a black rock shrine. They're located uh, all over the desert and uh, they're very highly sought after by everyone. So if you uh, see one uh, glowing which I'm kind of wondering how long until this one uh, glows again. Uh, it's been about mm, maybe two minutes or so. But I also wanted to show you what your compass does. A square with the compass will appear when something is around. And if it's purple, it's this, or uh, yeah, if it's like a dark purple, it's this black rock shrine and it will get stronger and stronger there we go you see it the closer you are so all you have to do is get up to it and click on offering and that's all there is to it you get uh these things but i also wanted to clarify one more thing and that is you're out here you're fighting you're getting a lot of items, like all of this strange stuff over here, like this right here, uh, rare Elyon rune, or uh, Naga spearheads, or this uh, fossilized forgone egg, or even this right here, desert Naga sash. Um, sure, all of these things can go for like maybe the collection but I wanted to point out when I first started I had a lot of garbage and I didn't know what to do with it so I'm gonna go back to uh, the closest oasis so I can show you that and here we go I want to show you this person right here right it's a little laggy sorry this person he's the appraiser so before you sell off things you want to see if you can get things appraised and just like um, when you're doing uh, uh, merchantry and you get those sealed treasure chests same concept you get these items that need to be appraised so you hit multi select and you select them all and then appraise them and now that they're known you can do something with it or sell it so while I'm at it I might as well take a moment to uh, explain uh, what uh, let's see where is it at there we go black spirit when you do questing you'll level him up one more and he looks like this kind of awkward and well there it is his gear is to design to equip runes and the fuse runes is uh, an option so when you're doing the storyline you'll get some runes that are uh, uh, gray you know like the regular standard color and then as you go out there you'll get better runes and different runes for example, the four on the left are usually PvP, damage received, damage dealt, uh, ow, damage increase, and I like this last one. Uh, tier 5, pet skill, level increase, plus 4%. This is a runic companionship. I really like that one. I'm not a big PvPer, so the only one that really works for me is the owl and the companion. But then when you come over here to the right side, these runes work for you. It's DP, so, uh, or excuse me, AP. So there's plus two AP, there's plus two DP, uh, dark energy experience, and the last one, field combat experience. So all of these are very helpful. As you can see, uh, the exclamation points, I got new runes. Let's see that one is damage dealt no nope. um, field combat experience no nope. so that's what you want to do is when you get all of this uh, what looks like garbage 
you go and you have it appraised by uh, this person. Uh, just look for the icon, the uh, scroll with the magnifying glass icon. They're in every town. And uh, once it's appraised, then you can go to the guy. Uh, you don't sell it to him, but you can come over here to... I'm in uh, the starter town, the one that you start in, the Sand Grain Bazaar. So and then you come over to this guy and sell off your stuff. Not bad, 23 million for just a few minutes work. Of course I did a boss too, but anyway, uh, that was it. It was just, like I said, very quick video to uh, answer the question, what do I do when my I'm, you know, have a lot of stuff? What do I do with this stuff? Where can I get it uh, appraised? Now you know. And uh, word to the wise, uh, it's always best to discover all the towns. Oops, excuse me. All these question mark towns, like go to them. Because when you want to participate in the Layton uh, World Boss event, which he spawns, everyone converges on him. Have your graphics set to low. Just big advice. And uh, go fight him. If you can teleport to the nearest town and then ride over to him, you'll be there quicker than everyone else. So I still need to unlock these things. And of course, at the end of the month, uh, it's all going to get wiped clean, and you start again. Uh, actually, that's not true. I think the towns stay. It's the uh, altars and everything else on the map that uh, changes. Yeah. So, that was it. Thank you very much for watching, and you guys, uh, subscribe if you like my videos. Uh, like it if you like it. Other than that, uh, you have a wonderful evening. Talk to you then. Bye now.